Um, this is how Smackbook works. If you want to download, if you want to get Smackbook, you must download Desktop Manager and AMS Tracker and Smackbook. So I have already thing downloaded in this file right here. And once you download everything, you just want to copy AMS Tracker into your Smackbook folder. All right, and then you want to open up Terminal. I've already I've already done that, but you don't. So I'm not gonna show you how to do it. But when you're done with everything, you can you basically can just hit the side of your computer like this. See, there's my terminal. So what you guys want to do is type in CD like this, and then another space, and then copy that whole Smackbook folder right here, and then hit Enter, and then type in P E R L space Smack dot P L, and after that hit Enter. And then just minimize that and then it'll be initialized and then just see just switch in between whatever whatever pages you have up I just selected four pages just to show you and you can go back and forth either way and how this works is there's a motion set the uh, a motion sensor in your in your MacBook and um, even if you just tilt your Mac even if you just tilt it See, I'm, I'm t even though you can't see me, I'm tilting it right now, and it, it switches. So, and if you want to change how it like works, like you see how mine switches and it's like a cube, you can see like a cube. Just hit this thing called right here. That's the that's the desktop manager like uh, file, and go to preference. Um, this is how Smackbook works. If you want to download, if you want to get Smackbook. You must download Desktop Manager and AMS Tracker and Smackbook. So I have already thing downloaded in this file right here. And once you download everything, you just want to copy AMS Tracker into your Smackbook folder. All right, and then you want to open up Terminal. I've already I've already done that, but you don't. Have so I'm not gonna show you how to do it. But when you're done with everything, you can you basically can just hit the side of your computer like this. See, there's my terminal. So, what you guys want to do is type in CD like this, and then another space, and then copy that whole Smackbook folder right here, and then hit enter. And then type in P E R L space smack dot P L. And after that, hit enter. And then just minimize that, and then it'll be initialized. And then just, see, just switch in between. Whatever, whatever pages you have up. I just selected four pages just to show you. And you can go back and forth either way. And how this works is there's a motion set, the uh, a motion sensor in your in your MacBook. And um, even if you just tilt your Mac, even if you just tilt it, see, I'm, I'm t even though you can't see me, I'm tilting it right now. And it, it switches so. And if you want to change how it like works, like you see how mine switches and it's like a cube, you can see like a cube. Just hit this thing called right here. That's the that's the desktop manager like uh, file, and go to preferences, and then you gotta find it. So right here, and go to desktops. And go to switch transition and just select whatever one you want. So I'll do warp. So now watch when I do it. See, it does a different thing every every time. Um, if you want to do any anything, warp and fade. See. So um, and you can also just change desktops by clicking on the things up here, like that. And uh, it's pretty simple. All right. Like that. Like this. And then you gotta find it. So right here. And go to desktops. And go to switch transition and just select whatever one you want. So I'll do warp. So now watch when I do it. See? It does a different thing every every time. Um if you wanna do any anything, warp and fade. See? So, um, and you can also just change desktops by clicking on the things up here, like that. 
and uh, it's pretty simple. Alright, thanks guys.